So in this video, let us continue to solve problems based on distance between two points. The question here is like this. Do the points 3, 2, negative 2, negative 3 and 2, 3 form a triangle? If so, name the type of triangle formed. Well, first of all, how do you find out, you know, if these three points form a triangle? Well, now the thing is, uh, say, let us name these points P of 3, 2 and Q of minus 2 comma minus 3 and R of 2 comma 3 right so now you now we just have to go ahead and find the distances between PQ QR and PR sum of any two of these distances is greater than the third distance therefore the points uh, P, Q, and R form a triangle so let's first find PQ PQ is what square root of 3 minus of minus 2 which is plus 2 3 plus 2 the whole square plus 2 minus of minus 3 which is plus 3 the whole square so what we've got here is uh, square root of 5 square plus 5 square which is equal to square root of 50 now this is approximately equal to 7.07 .07 square root of 50 and then we've got qr qr is square root of minus 2 minus 2 the whole square plus minus 3 minus 3 the whole square which is equal to square root of minus 4 square plus minus 4 square plus minus 6 square which is uh, 4 square is 16 and 6 square is 36 36 plus 16 is what minus 4 into minus 4 is uh, plus 16 minus 6 into minus 6 is plus 36 so 36 plus 16 is 52 so, so square root of 52 now this is approximately equal to 7.21 right and then we've got uh, pr pr is square root of 3 minus 2 the whole square plus 2 minus 3 the whole square which is equal to square root of 1 square plus minus 1 the whole square which is square root of 2 this is approximately equal to 1.41 now, uh, when we've got the three lines, you know, when three distances, three distances, now if you have a check if those uh, three points form the vertices of a triangle, then the condition is that any two sides, the sum of any two sides should be greater than the third side. So, you know, check 7.07 .07 plus 1.41 is greater than 7.21 or 7.21 plus 1.41 is greater than 7.07. .07. So, in this way, we confirm that these three vertices, uh, P, Q and R are indeed are the ones of a, of a triangle so now if now the next question is if so name the type of the triangle form well you can see that you know if at all this is a right angle triangle this is going to be the hypotenuse right so it will be qr square equals pq square plus pr square let's see if this is uh, true so we've got root 52 the whole square equals root of 50 the whole square plus root 2 the whole square so the square gets cancelled so it's 52 equals 50 plus 2 because the root and the square gets cancelled the root and the square get cancelled so then we have 52 equals 52 so yes therefore not only that it is a triangle it is also a right angle triangle because it uh follows the Pythagoras theorem that is the hypotenuse squared equal to the sum of the square of the other two sides you can clearly see that the longest side here is the hypotenuse so the hypotenuse square equals to the square the sum of the square of the other two sides so that's exactly what we've got here 52 equals 52 so hence uh, we've uh, not only found if these three vertices are are uh, part of a triangle uh, we've also found that they are part of a right angle triangle as well so this ends this uh, problem as well as this video. Let's solve more problems based on distance between two points in the forthcoming videos.